Hello, my darlings. Happy Wednesday Day to all of you, and welcome back to Let's Build the Worlds. I have no idea. No idea. Hello. Part four. Part four of Brindleton Isle Castle. We are continuing with more of exterior work today. Um, I've done a little bit of work off camera. I've also managed to get MC Command Center, the new one, get that downloaded. So I was able to make all of the Sims have the kind of like the skills that they need that kind of matches their personalities and whatnot. Um, and yes, so today, as I said, more exterior work. We'll be up on top of the castle, I think, today, doing the kind of like bonfire area, um, Caspian's balcony area, and also the little like herb garden area that I want to do. That's what we're going to be doing today. We are. Blue is in the background. He is fast asleep. It's so warm today. I've been sat out in the garden for half an hour to get some D in me. <laughs> um, and I was sweating my tits off. It's like 13 degrees Celsius here today. <laughs> but no, spring is definitely on its way. Um, but yeah, I don't know why I'm talking about spring, but we did. Um, without further ado, let's get over and stop building. Okay, my dears, here we are. We are back at Brindleton Isle Castle. Um, all the crops have started to grow it's it's spring loves things are just starting to come alive you know um i didn't really change anything from last time down here i was i did put out some food bowls because while i was like doing their skills and their skill cheats um the dog and cat was hungry shark and squid was very hungry so i got some food bowls out for them just to so I can feed them. I don't want to see an animal suffering. Thank you. Even if it is in The Sims. Um, I've also put some visual effects on the pond. Like the kind of moat area. So we've put some fash in there. And some of those fireflies as well. Um, and I've also. I'm, I completely like always forget about the ladders. So I've put a ladder in. And I saw a couple of you guys say. Why don't you put a ladder in. Instead of doing a staircase on the back. Um, so this now gives them access. To be able to get up into this area here which is what we're going to be concentrating on today um this is obviously caspian's private balcony moment i'm going to have this as, um caspian's private bathroom in the turret i thought that would be a really cool idea um so up here is where we're going to be growing the herbs and all kinds of good stuff and this is going to be their kind of like bonfiery area now these two here i would love if we could get access up to them just for some kind of gameplay up here um, but I don't know what we're going to do about that just yet. So I'm going to leave it for a second um, and come back to it when I can. So anyway, let's start on the herb garden area, I think, first. Um, hello, how are you? I hope you all had a nice weekend. I really do. Um, if you guys were listening to this people just say, I had a bit of a sad boy day yesterday. I, I get them from time to time. And I think it's human to get them from time to time. Um, but I just felt really, really crap. Really, really crap all day long. Um, and I just want to, I can't, I'm, I'm almost trying to like just normalize the fact that you can feel bad every now and again. Uh, because I don't think enough people talk about it on the internet. Um, and you, you with my content and stuff, you're probably thinking, how does he stay positive all the time? The truth is, I don't. Sorry about that, my loves. I had delivery at the door. Delivery at the door, that was. Um, but yeah, as I was saying, like, I'm not, like, 100% positive all the time. I don't think anybody can be 100% positive all the time because I just think that would just be weird. <laughs> not weird, just unrealistic, you know? Um, you've got to go through these emotions. We are human after all, my sweets. Um, and yeah, just wanted to say that. Just wanted to say that. But what did help massively was streaming last night. Streaming really, really helped. Um, yeah. Yeah. As soon as I started streaming and I'm around you guys, like the community, it just, I don't know, it does something to me. It makes me feel very happy. It really, really does. Uh, oh, money fruit. I've, do these need to go on like a big one? Or can they just be put in there? I don't, I've never seen this before. Never seen a money fruit. But I thought that could have been a good way to make money as well. Why don't we do a few of these? Let's do a few money fruits. Unless they need like a bigger... 8,000 simoleons. I didn't realise that was that expensive. <laughs> My God. Oh, well. Oh, well. I'm not going to give them too much money either when it comes to kind of gameplay. So they can kind of make their own sort of money. Um, and it won't be as high as kind of this, what they've got going on now. But we need to be able to cancel, darlings, don't we? 
Um, I don't really like the layout of that. It looks a bit meh. It looks just a bit crap. But what I'm thinking about doing is having like, like a little barbecue area up here. So I might even do a picnic table with a parasol on top of the castle. <laughs> I think that could be quite cute, actually. Um, yeah, let me pull out a few more things. Okay, we're just going to do this together because I've just lost a bit. I lost track of what I was doing then. I started putting in a bloody washing line downstairs. Um, <laughs> so we're going to do this together. We're going to do it together. Um, and what I've decided here is I'm going to do a little planter box moment at the back here. Uh, let's go for a darker brown. I'm going to do a little planter moment here using some soil. Just so it kind of fills that space up quite nicely. Yeah, I think that's cute. I think that's cute. And here, I want to try and make it look like there's some storage for some gardening equipment and whatnot. So, probably like one of those old chests or something that we've got. Where are you? Come here. Uh, let's get rid of debug and live edit for the minute. Because you're very distracting. Um, oh. Oh, yeah, this will do as well. We'll have one of these up here. We'll have one of those. But I also wanted... Let's get rid of custom content so it doesn't tease me. I was thinking just something like a chest up here where it would look like... They could store all of their gardening equipment and whatnot. And whatnot, you know? I think I'm going to do that. And let's go for the darker brun. Yeah, that's kind of cute. We'll do that. We'll do that. And I do... I don't know if the hose is going to fit up here anywhere. I'm going to try and see. Hose! <laughs> Wall-mounted garden hose reel. Will you go here without looking too weird? Oh, you kind of do. You do poke out the top a little bit. But I don't really... I can look past that. Just so it looks like they can get here and water those plants then. Yeah, I'm into it. I don't want any kind of like structure over the top of it or anything. Or do I? Hmm. Let's have a little look at that. I was, what I'm thinking. What I'm thinking is not a pergola. It's probably going to look absolutely shit. But I'm just going to have a little look just to see what it looks like. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't... I don't think that's the vibe for this castle, Aiden. <laughs> Definitely not, no. And not even a pergola or anything. We'll just keep it open. It's fine. But we just need to try... We need to do trial it, darlings. Yes, we did. Um, right, I'm going to get rid of Get Together. And I just want to fill this up. I could probably put some just some of these on there with some flowers in it. That would be cute. Yes. Are, are they going to poke up the wall, though? No. Oh, oh! Fucking hell. Why did I jump then? I wasn't... You weren't falling, Aiden. It's a game, love. <laughs> Thought I was bloody falling then, loves. <laughs> yeah, that's cute. Yeah, just something like that with some flowers. Um, nothing. Oh, these ones would be perfect. Yes. And I'll like just make them smaller. Whiffle them across on this area here. Put you back a bit, my darling. You like that there. And then we'll do a smaller one at the end. Just so it looks like they've got a little bit of a planty growth going up here. Once these are all planted and stuff. I'm thinking these are for the small ones. I'm going to testicles it. <gasps> testicles. I will test it by putting the... Oh, it goes in the middle. So it's going to need... Those are trees. Okay. Well, we'll have trees up here. <laughs> I think we'll have four. We'll get rid of one. Ah! 1,600 back. After I spent 8k fuming absolutely fuming i should get the matching um oh god i'm gonna have to go into debug get the matching planter that goes with those smaller ones shouldn't we uh come here my darling here you are sweetheart right i'm gonna flop a tree there oh i'm gonna have to like barbecue area we're not doing that anymore decided we're not doing a barbecue area anymore i'll put a barbecue downstairs they've got outside seating downstairs anyway um Ah, this is kind of like in a weird spot now. I might have to like plonk you over here. Uh, in fact, I'll do you there. You there. I will meander this around in a sec. Just so I can get that one up on the taller kind of height of the wall. Um, Let's put them all around like that. And I might even put some soil and stuff at the bottom. We'll think about that a bit later. Um, So yes, tree. Money tree. Don't know how. Do they need to like grow? Have they got a season? They better not have a season. No. Okay. Eh? Why are they only 1,600? Didn't we just spend 8k on them? Am I going mad? Probably. And we're all going to be here for it, aren't we, darlings? Yes. Yes is the answer to that. Right. And we've got one more there, but mm, I might be able to whiffle one more here. I mean, that's just 
going to wreck the formation, but no, that looks shit. I think what I'll do is whiffle you there and then flop you there like that. Mm, you probably could go closer, couldn't you? Yeah, that's fine. Like that. Stunning. Oh, God, it's wonky. Oh, it's wonky. <laughs> well, what? Where? Did I? Did I get rid of some? What, what went on then? Oh, those were the money trees. I was like, what? why have I only got some of these planters left? Where have they all gone? <laughs> Aiden, get your shit together, please. Right, so I'm going to whiffle these around a bit more now then. Uh, I could probably put another couple more here, couldn't I? Yeah, we'll do that. And then I'm going to whiffle you into there. And then I'm going to whiffle you. Is that the same spot as it was last time it was? That's fine. I don't like it. <laughs> Why am I so fussy? I'm not. It's because I'm a bad girl. Don't even need to answer that. Um, yeah, I'm going to pop you there instead then. You're going to come over here. This is going to be the place where the storage is. In fact, I'm going to get rid of you. See you later. Cardboard box on top of a castle. It just doesn't make sense. If it rains, it would just go soggy. You know? Realism loves. Realism. He says while he's planting money trees on top of a castle. <laughs> Realism. That's all I'm going to say. That is all I'm going to say on the matter. Um, yeah, lovely. Right, and then you, yep, you go that way. Stunning. You go this way. And I think what I'm going to do, I'm just going to quickly go over to live mode. And I'm going to get the Sims to plant this so it looks nice. So give me one sec. Okay, things have been planted. Don't know why these two haven't grown. How very dare you. What was this one? Lovely mushroom. It did grow. I'm sure it did because I saw it. Um... <laughs> got trees on top of the castle but they're money trees loves i'm kind of into it kind of into it they can get to everything it's all good they've managed to water it all and whatnot i tried to make them do a fire dance around this but they it, they said that there was not enough room i don't know why because look at look i don't know why i have no idea why they can't do a fire dance around that that's very annoying because i wanted um i wanted it for storyline purposes but anyway what i'm going to do instead is use those lamps from i forgot what pack they came from but those like fire lanterns from get famous the Bra braziers a brazier let's use these instead then because we can put the flame on these if i put one there oh don't don't go floating please are you floating no she's not floating she's fine she's fine we'll put one there as well and then another one in this corner here oh god that's wonky you need to go there. We've got some fire brazers up here. I'm kind of into that. Kind of into that idea. Well, if they can't bloody um, do their fire dance, then I'm going to put some seaweed around. <laughs> I'm going to put some seaweed around. I was I was worried that this, that's not the seaweed I want. The seaweed is down here, actually, because I put it in this little area here. There we go. Let's put some of this up there as well. They're elixir of life. They're seaweed. Now... Um, I'm going to put one on each point, each point of this compass, darlings. I'm going to put one, I'm going to put a little bunch of seaweed just because of the way of the fish, you know. It doesn't need a reason, it's just the way it is. It's part of their um, ceremony. They have to sprinkle north, east, south and west with seaweed. <laughs> and that is it. That is the moment that we're going for today. I'm leaving it. I'm, I like that area as it is. I think that will do well. That would do well. I'm annoyed that they can't do a fire dance, but we're just going to have to leave it. So, on to Caspian's private balcony area. I'm thinking this would be an area he comes out here to relax in. So, we're going to get a yoga mat out here. Let's use one of these ones. That one's got... Oh, no, that's the teaching one. We are going to do one of these... Oh, look at the size of it. I didn't really... Oh, no, that fits perfectly. Oh, good. Now, I don't know... Oh, it doesn't fit perfectly. And I don't know what room we're going to do the yoga bit in. Maybe just off of Caspian's bedroom, actually. That would kind of make sense, putting it up this high. I think he could, they could easily fit in here. Even if I do that, I will player test it. And I'll probably change the colour of that rug as well, I'm unsure. Um, but I want them to have a whole room of yoga as well. It's one of their things. It's one of their group activities. They do it every day in the morning at 5 a.m., um, so that is the moment. Right, okay, use this one here. Where can I pop you quite nicely? Um, hmm, I think maybe like forwards over this way would be nice. Putting it right there. 
and then he's got a full view of the sea while he's doing it. Oh, I'm into that idea. Yes, I am. So this is the area he needs some relaxation, maybe a few little skill building things. Um, and just this little like private hangout space. Oh, shit. I forgot to put the wall back up here. Main reasons being, darlings, this is where I put access up to. Um, oh, why are they like that for? Are they? Are you supposed to be that big? No idea. I'm just going to put it in like that. It's fine. Um, oh, I did a straight edge there. That's why. Okay. Hang on a sec. <laughs> I told you I'm not with it today. Oh, go away. Not you, love. Not you. Perfect. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So let me just go and grab a few objects out that I think would match in well. What's going on here now? Sims. Sims is going on there. Um, yeah, let me go and grab a few objects out. Right, I've pulled out a few things. I've pulled out a few things. So we're going to start placing them around together. I just thought this here would look really cute over the door. I'm now going to have to... Oh, that can go in. It's fine. I'm on about that little bit of greenery that was poking through there. Is this going to poke indoors, though? Oh, it does a little bit, look. Well, let's move you, meander you out a little bit more. Oh, and a little bit more. Just as ni a nice little bit of greenery um, around the door. I'm for that. I really am. I'm going to flop his little uh, rocking chair here. Now, he does love to knit, so we're going to have to give him some kind of knitting thing. Um, why, where do I find that? I never know where that is, ever. There we go. His own little private knitting bag for all things nitty. Um, I'm, I've gave him a paddling pool. <laughs> Because obviously he is the only mermaid. Um, so I'm going to give him a paddling pool. Uh, <laughs> for him to splash around his fin and whatnot. And I'm thinking this still might fit over there quite nicely actually. Oh it does. Yeah that's not too bad. That is not too bad. And I thought just for added privacy moments. Maybe I could just put a little row of these across here. So they can't see him if he does get into the paddling pool. I'm unsure if mermaids' tails come when they're in the paddling pool. I'm unsure. We will play a test it and see what happens. But I'm sure one of you guys will let me know. And his own little private um, sun lounger as well. Yeah, that looks fine. I'm for it. And I think what I'm going to do here, I'm going to flop in a little side table. What we got going on in Nifty Knitting? A little one of those outdoor side table thingamajigs. Uh, and I'll put a cheeky little drink on top of it as well. Cheeky little drink on top of it. Not you. Why am I getting out the orange one? For goodness sake, this one. Yes, that's perfect. Flop you to there. Activities and skills. Isn't it in this area here? I'm sure it is. <gasps> oh, oh, maybe tea. Like a little tea set. Oh, a pink tea set <laughs> for Caspian. No, we'll go with blue. We'll go with... No, we're going to go with pink. We're going to go with the pink tea set. He sits up here as a little cup of tea while he's sunbathing. Oh, I can totally imagine it. I really can. Very much so. Now, I just think this area needs some, like, plants and stuff up here too. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to flop some plants around. Um, Some big bushy boys would be nice. Not so much tropical looking. Oh, obviously I'm going to be using these because I love... I love these ones. Probably my favourite plant, to be honest with you, in The Sims 4. Um, is this little variety we've got going on here, which is was from Snowy Escape, I think. I can't quite remember, but I'm sure it was from Snowy Escape. I just think it's really cute. We'll flop a bit more greenery around there. Oh, it's like a little oasis around here. It really is. And then I want to use those... Um, where are they? Those little lanterns that I've been using everywhere. There we go. I'm going to flop a couple up here um can we get down to where we're working aiden it would be a lot easier my love flop you to there and then you over to there as well just so we've got some outside lighting going on here oh and maybe one above the toilet i can just plonk it into the actually yeah there we go and then the door won't hit it then because that's the door frame that yeah cute <laughs> This is so random. This is so random. And obviously, it's not to my tastes. But we're doing it for storyline purposes, darlings. Absolute storyline purposes. Um, I'm going to put a little plant down here as well. Might use a bit of colour, actually, for there. No, no. Oh, oh yeah, you. A little bit of a citrus tree going on there. <clears throat> Lovely. And then maybe a little um, plant around this area as well. 
Let's do it. Plop one around there. Beautiful. Maybe a couple of candles around here. Oh, I could put them on top there, couldn't I? Um, Just those little... I wish we had some more just singular candles like this. Like this came with Dine Out. Um, That was so long ago. Yeah, just maybe a little... A few little cheeky candles by his yoga area. Oh, I'm into that. <clears throat> I'm into that idea. But it's just like his little oasis of a garden. I'm kind of... Yeah, I'm here for it. Absolutely here for it. Now... I'm going to cough. What I've been thinking. Because I do want these people... I do want these sims to be very eco-conscious. I'm going to do, like, maybe some solar panels around this area. The ones that you can put on the floor. But then I was thinking about adding in the wind turbines on top of these turrets. We were, like, ifing or amming... Or I was ifing or amming whether to get um, access up here... I think I'm going to put some wind turbines. It's going to completely destroy. Um, oh, are they just called turbines then? Turbine. There we go. Roof turbine stunning. Um, because then. Oh, are they too big? <laughs> yeah. Let's go for these. <laughs> Let's go for the actual roof ones, Aiden, shall we? Let's flop these on top. One there. And then one on the other one as well. <laughs> well, they, they're moving with the times, this castle. They really are moving with the times, this cult. So that's what we're going to make them do. And then solar panel-wise, if... Yeah, I was thinking... Oh, they're huge. Oh, I could maybe fit two here, though, couldn't I? Let's see. We'll, we'll go for the blue as well. Let's go for the darker. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to have to move that tree. That tree is no longer here with us, and neither... Oh, and neither is that window. Goodbye. Uh, oh, the ivy's not too bad. Let me um clamber this around and connect it around with this other side here. Just so it kind of looks like it's growing. There, there we are. There we are. We've got two. How much? I don't know how much power that will give away. That grass looks fine there. But that's kind of hidden it away over to this side. I'm into it. <laughs> looks so weird. But I'm going to do it. It's all for this storyline. It's the storyline of this um, cult. <laughs> oh, what would we like? Tell you what we like. Silly bums, love. Absolute silly bums. But um, I think I'm going to leave it here for today. I've kind of hit a wall. I've kind of hit a wall. And I'm, I am I can't get out of that wall today. <laughs> I really can't. Um, but we'll be back tomorrow. I think I'm going to do a, a little bit more off of camera. I just want some few more details on the outside of this. And we're going to make our way into the interiors tomorrow, I think. We're going to make our way into the interiors. But I will leave you with this lovely weird view of a castle with wind, wind turbines and whatnot. Oh my God, that lighting does not do it any favours. There we go. That's a much better, <laughs> much better vibe. Anyway, I'm going to leave you now. Thank you so much for watching, my darlings. I'll be back with this tomorrow. I'll see you then. Goodbye.